Hello everyone, welcome to the Software Coding Tutorials channel. My name is Tommy. Today I will be talking about the installation of Linux Distro with WSL in Windows 11. So what is WSL? WSL stands for Windows Subsystem for Linux. It's a feature of Windows operating system that enables you to run a Linux file system along with Linux command line tools and GUI apps directly on Windows alongside your traditional Windows desktops and apps. This is available under Windows 10 and 11, but I will demonstrate this under Windows 11. So what's covered in this tutorial? I will be covering two basic commands. One is to list the distro, which we have here, WSL-L-O. The second command will be installing it, so WSL dash dash install dash d and your favorite distro in this case this is Debian afterward you want to restart your computer and there should be an icon in your startup screen okay and if you receive errors there are two types of errors I've detected so far one says that um, requires an update to its kernel component with this hex here and so you want to follow this link that I provided aka.ms slash WSL to kernel and download the MSI which installs the update and then the problem will go away and the second error will be uh, stating that your virtual machine could not be started because it requires a feature that's not installed that w means that you want to enable virtualization in your computer BIOS and or enable Hyper-V whichever um, that that is required first so try to do so okay so let's begin our tutorial by clicking on the start um, icon so next let's look for terminal okay this is the um, a more uh, enhanced version of the DOS prompt that you get with Windows so at this point type in WSL-L-O to list our distro and so the second step is to install it so type in WSL-install-D uh, and uh, in this case I'm going to be installing Debian now it's going to take uh, a couple minutes to install this okay now it's asking me for a username so I'm gonna put Tommy okay and I'm gonna put whatever the password is okay and then we basically in the uh, Linux prompt okay so let's just shut this down for a moment okay so if you go click on the start menu you will see that uh, it install Debian GNU Linux okay so click on that and you can see it open up with the new uh, prompt here you can do ls that dash LTR etc okay the uh, Debian installation does not have any software that I want so in order to do so I need to do sudo app get update okay and then I enter my password next I want to install my um, if I do vim right it's not available so sudo app get install vim and click on Y for yes okay now I have Vim 
and if I want to install for example if I type G++ that's not available as well so type in sudo app get install G++ and G++ is now available so, so type in G++ dash version and here you got it okay so for any other program that you need um, you will have to basically install it manually um, because uh, each of the VM uh, I'm sorry each of the distro that you install is very much empty okay so um, so that's all I have for this tutorial. Um, thank you very much for watching. And if you have any question, leave a comment below. And uh, you know, if I've got time, I can respond to it. And so thank you very much for watching. See you next time.